Welcome back guys, in this video I will be testing the popular cooperative third person shooter game Helldivers 2 on my Steam Deck running on SteamOS. PC version of this game is very demanding on the hardware, poorly optimized to be honest. It does not even support FSR 2 upscaler, in-game upscaler looks very blurry. I will be using SteamOS FSR. By default it runs in DirectX 12 mode. You will get slightly better performance on Steam Deck using DirectX 11 mode. In order to force the game to run in DirectX 11 mode, just need to add this launch option select the game in your steam library then click on the settings cog here click on properties under launch options add this line of text i'll give it in the description of this video just copy it from there and paste it here if you are switching from directx 12 to directx 11 mode it's recommended to delete the previous shader cache files they are present in this directory steam version of hell divers 2 just delete all of the files and folders present here do not worry they will be generated automatically when you launch the game, switch to SteamOS gaming mode. This game becomes more demanding on higher difficulties due to the increase in the number of enemies. Connected my Gully Kit KK3 Max Gamepad to Steam Deck via Bluetooth mode. Using Proton Experimental as the compatibility layer. Steam Deck compatibility playable. I'll be playing the game on hard difficulty. I have the LCD variant of Steam Deck, it's running on SteamOS version 3.5.17, stable build, using Cryo Utility 2's version 2, recommended settings, performance tab, overlay level set to 2, frame rate limit set to 60, refresh rate set to 60 as well, scaling filter set to FSR, sharpness level 3, can even verify this, and just set the overlay level to 4, FSR status on go back to level 2 and show you the in-game settings these are character display settings native resolution set to 800 by 500 pixels render scale set to native display mode set to window I'm basically using the low preset I change texture quality from low to medium FX AA a big upon anti lazing enabled. That's it. I had to sacrifice most of the settings. Our ship. I'll just start a quick play match. You're here. The galaxy awaits yourself. Power draw is around 25 watts. 45 FPS. Quick play. Change difficulty level to hard. Other players select my gear, jump into the map, bow to land. Landed on the planet. Use a stratagem. FPS is around 30 to 37. Better to cap the FPS at 30 for a more stable experience. Join my teammates. Out of action is going on here. Perfect for testing. Okay, explosion caused the FPS to drop down to around 25. I got the game. <laughs> oh my god! I'll summon a precision strike, whatever it's called. Let's see what happens. There you go. Not safe here. Some shitty cash related status. Just cap the FPS to 30. You can play the game on Steam Deck, but the performance is not ideal. Occasional hitches. 
CPU load is around 86% very high GPU load as well take out the tin can oh no got killed waiting for respawn My pod landed. Call in a special weapon. Very difficult to view the arrow keys properly. Small in size. Take foliage here. It's raining. got my gun not much action is going on here we're getting a stable 30 fps three players fourth one is coming their pod Action, perfect. Oh my god, explosion again caused the hitch. Objective complete. FPS dropped down to down 19. Can't do much here, guys. Not even hitting the GPU bottleneck. Game is just too much for Steam Deck's processor. Expect slowdowns on higher difficulties. Setting the swap size to 16 GB helped in preventing the game from crashing. And summon a sentry. Clear the area. So that's it with the videos. I hope you find it useful. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.